Hi friends, uh, we are going to do a short video on another topic that we've been following with you guys. This is soy sugiban. So this technique of treating the wood is natural, organic, without any chemicals. One year ago, we did all this treating with soy sugiban technique, in which you can uh, see the link up there. So we are doing a one year update on how it has fared after all the rains. South Florida gets all the rains and all the decomposition happens pretty fast. So this is a Douglas fir wood and we used it for composting. So we were putting all the you know fallen leaves and everything was wet. We got a very dark compost from this whole thing. And we can see there is, the wood looks okay because next I'm going to show you how it looks if it's not treated. So this is kind of a comparison video between treated and untreated wood. So come with me and I'll show you untreated portion of the wood. The same wood if it's left untreated, how it looks. So this is how it looks when it is untreated. The termites have already gotten the best of it. This is the same Douglas fir wood, same um, composition and everything. This also had the same, um, you know, decomposing materials, leaves and everything here. But this is what it would have been if we had not done the shoisugi band technique. And for those who do not want any chemicals in their wood, and if you want to use the wood for growing uh, greens and veggies for your own consumption, uh, I think uh, this is the best technique, shoisugi band and I hope you will follow us. Maybe we will have a two year follow up, we don't know. <laughs> so fingers crossed, thank you very much. This is soy sugiban. This is su sugiban. This is so sugiban. <laughs> what is it? The correct one. <laughs>